everybody, it's Andy, a.k.a. Max Ryder. We are back with another episode of Minecraft in single player. And we're bidding the village farewell. We're going to be heading, that's north, so we're heading east, away from this village, to see what else lies on this world. This village has it all, man. <laughs> Rivers, mountains, hills, everything except for, like, not being just a terrible mess. I don't know how to fix that. So, aside from just completely redoing a lot of stuff, and what we might do is come back and make that village our own. But we're going to explore the rest of these plains first and see where they go. Gosh, there's a lot of horses on the server. I really, really want... I really want... Oh, here, just in case anybody wants to see, there's the seed. I didn't put anything in for the seed, I just took a random seed, so that's the that's the number that comes up for seed. Do I have any food? I should probably get some stuff cooking, shouldn't I? Because I really don't have anything I can eat that's worth eating. Raw potatoes, that's about it. Oh, turn on the timer here. If we can find a nicer village that's not quite so messed up, we might settle there. If we can't, then we're probably going to come back to this village, but we're going to just explore a little ways first. There's fish in the water. I haven't really played much Minecraft at all in the last several months. Since August, actually. But I started live streaming it because I ran out of options. And I really enjoyed it. I miss it. I miss, whoops, let's not run. We're just walking. We'll do some more exploring. I have missed it. it, it I do enjoy Minecraft, even if, even if it does get a bit grindy. I I really have a lot of fun fixing up, mainly fixing up villages and then potentially building some of my own stuff at a later time. I need to get out of that groove though of just, hey, I'm going to fix up a village. But I do enjoy it a lot. I love finding new things. I wish there were more structures that you could find, like, like a house. If I could find like a random building, that might be like, it, it, would, it would encourage me to to decide to maybe live there instead of living in a village or dealing with villagers. I'm saying village way too much. There's nothing in this direction. We're still heading east. But we got a bed. I went ahead and made a bed with what little... Oh, look, more horses. There are a lot of horses. And a lot of divots. Okay, so it looks like our plains might be ending up here. More forests. And this is regular, uh, the setup is regular Minecraft. I uh, switched to hard, but we aren't doing anything spectacular. Yeah, this looks like the end of the plains. Then we're into forests. I understand in 1.14 you're going to be able to find more structures, or at least you'll be able to find villagers in villages in any kind of environment, that kind of thing, and there's going to be different types of pillagers as well as villagers or illagers. I don't know what they're called. We're going to end up working our way back to this village and taking it over, I'm afraid. It's just the way things are. Normally on a um, normally on like a multiplayer server, I will head for one corner of the map and make my home there with whatever happens to be there. Look at that tree. Holy crap. That's a that's a big tree. It's on a big hill. Removing water. Exploration is always a lot of fun too. I like I like seeing what I can see. Whoops, does not run. I don't think I've eaten yet. I got plenty of food, I gotta cook everything though, so I should have grabbed some carrots probably. Okay, there are mules, donkeys, excellent. And part of the reason I'm recording is um, I've run out of different games to record. Another reason is that I finished up a lot of my, um, a lot of the prep for my tabletop game. So I've been kind of just not doing much of anything and feeling kind of blah about, about that. 
I, I want to um, I'm trying to fill up my time. That's basically what's going on here. As I slowly, slowly walk. I think the village is that way. This is a typical, pretty typical world. No, I don't have been any big surprises yet. Uh, I know some about 1.13, like the kelp and that kind of stuff. You can actually cook that and eat it. Is this a desert? Is there a desert up here? I see cactus, so I'm guessing that it is. I've lived in desert villages before, and I don't particularly care for it. I do like spruce villages. I think those are sweet. As we look for a home, I don't want to go back to that first village, but whoa. Alright, this is the kind of stuff that interests me. Just just how that looks is cool, I think. It looks like there'll be plenty of uh let's go up over this rise here. Oh bunnies, they scare me. We'll go up to that spot, and then I guess we'll start heading back towards that other village to make it our home. If I don't see anything cool, which I don't think I will. Hey, bunnies. They say uh, eventually... What? What in the world is that floating island? These more planes over here? I'm always drawn to planes. I just like them. Then I ruin them by planting trees everywhere. Damn, we still have lost any haunches. I'm not figuring out. I haven't figured out what's up with that. I tell you what, I'm glad hanging sand won't drop just because you walk across it. My god, that would be terrifying. This is a very plane covered map oh, they're fun they're fun to walk across um there's another village woo we did it we found our second village and it looks like it's like just north of the first one maybe whoa look at this place is that the tree i saw earlier I'm not going to check it out quite yet. Let's see how far this plane stretches. And then we'll head over there. Uh, is that jungle? Uh, no, that's a mesa. Is that a mesa? No, a savanna. Okay, so savanna over there. Let's see what we got here with these people. Come on, blacksmith shop. Yeah, this isn't the same place. This one is a little bit nicer setup. It looks like it's flatter. Oh, a little bit. Oh, God, this hill needs to come out so bad. It's not even funny. This will be a lot of digging for this one. Fix it up. A lot of guard posts. Hey, buddy. hey people, what's up? Hmm. All right, two villages, kind of on a north-south pattern. Let's check. Uh, I don't remember the coordinates of the first one. 174, negative 715. A couple fields that aren't really grown. This is a cute little town. It's got some problems, obviously. It's got a lot of places that are going to have to be terraformed. Hey, horse, what's up? And a cave right here, right in the middle of town. That's just great. I think we might settle here, actually. Let's head south and real quick. Oh, we're about to run out of daylight, so we're about to end the episode. What's going on over here? Good lord. All right, that's just a mess. 
So I think we're going to set up camp here, folks. Uh, next time we're going to see what relation these two villages are in. Uh, or something like that. And maybe we'll start renovating this place. Huh. That's not good. I don't have any torches yet, either. So... We're going to conclude here. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I appreciate it. And I will talk to you all next time.